Hey guys, welcome back. I'm going to show you today Glovebox. What Glovebox does very cleverly is let me open from pretty much anywhere one of my predetermined apps. And even if, so if I'm in one, I can come in and select another one. Um, so it, it's it is quite clever in that, so I can carry on just swiping left and right. It's only when I come in right from the edge that I uh, that I get it. So let's have a look. Where's the blooming icon? There it is. So glove box down in the bottom left there. Um, bar list. So this is where we actually set what apps. Now because I'm on the free version I can only have I think eight apps or whatever but I mean you can basically oh I didn't realize I could add a widget actually. Oh yeah that's only on the preview. <laughs> Maybe I should have bought it to show you the full the full features. But generally yeah so I'm limited at eight. You can pretty much add any app though. You can change the order of the apps. I've got a phone down near the bottom. There it is, down near the bottom. Um, I mean, that's it, really. It's not massively complicated. Um, oh, sorry, there are there are other options I should show you. Um, so you see the red little red line down the side there. You can change, so you can make it quite a sort of specific very small. It's only going to work when you come in at that point, and nothing else is going to do anything. Look. Um, I don't, oh yeah, if you're going to do it, <laughs> if you're going to do it, do it proper, the whole right hand side of the screen. Um, disable in landscape, vibrate on touch, glove box transition effects, sensor, sensibility level, bar opacity, so let's open it, if we, oh we can't change that, that's a pro version only. Um, and you can change, where is it? Oh yeah, so you can you can have it on the left side only. Now, I, to be honest, that's the side I have been using it because the problem with on the right hand side where it's gone now, your thumb then covers with your selections. Or at least if you come over this way, I can then see what I'm choosing. But it can be a bit awkward coming across to that side of the screen. But that's it, glove box. So this is the free version. Let's just see if we can check real quickly how much. The premium is two forty seven. So it, I don't know. If it had been seventy p, sold definitely, no doubt. Two forty seven, really, just so I've got a few couple of extra apps down the bottom. I can't. It's handy to get into things at a quick swipe, but it's not, I don't know, 247, just I feel like they've priced it slightly out of the market, not out of the market, but above my necessity for that, for the pro features. Um, but, oh, so still it is sometimes easy to, to miss. Um, but it is very nice app, very handy, very useful, some people find it more useful than others perhaps. Oops, and it is, you know, as you can see, you can still miss it sometimes. But yeah, especially for me when I like my minimalistic display, but there are still some apps I want to be able to get to nice and easy. So there we go, Glovebox. Free version and a £2.47 version on Google Play now. My name's Andy, catch you all again soon.